what if everything you knew about searching the internet was about to change? In San Francisco, a small team of innovators is taking on tech's biggest giant, Google. Meet Perplexity AI, the startup that hit $9 billion valuation faster than almost anyone in Silicon Valley. So what's their secret? Ditching the endless pages of ads and links for straight answers, powered by advanced AI. With investment from Jeff Bezos and tech companies like NVIDIA, they're not just building another search engine, they're reimagining how we find answers online. But can this platform really change how billions of us access information? The journey of Perplexity AI began with a team of four visionaries, Erevin Srinivas, Dennis Yaritz, Johnny Ho, and Andy Konwinski. Their combined experiences across tech giants and academic institutions shaped the foundation of Perplexity, infusing the company with deep knowledge in artificial intelligence and large language models. Each founder brought unique expertise and insights that contributed to its rapid development. Erevin Srinivas, the CEO of the company, had a formative experience working as an AI researcher at OpenAI and Google Brain. Originally from Chennai, India, Srinivas pursued advanced studies in AI and deep learning at UC Berkeley, which included a major internship at Google DeepMind in London. This experience opened his eyes to the challenges and opportunities in AI, specifically around enhancing user-centric information accessibility. It was in 2018, during a summer internship at OpenAI, that Srinivas realized the limitations of traditional search engines. This insight sparked his determination to create a more user-focused search platform that could harness the power of AI to deliver precise, conversational answers. Dennett Yaritz, Perplexity's CTO, previously worked as an AI scientist at Meta, where he explored the most recent advancements in AI and machine learning. Johnny Ho, the company's chief strategy officer, held engineering roles at Quora, and Andy Konwinski, another co-founder, was on the founding team at Databricks. Each of these experiences equipped the founders with a deep understanding of the digital information landscape and its limitations. Together, they envisioned a search tool capable of offering users accurate information while minimizing the ad-driven model that has long dominated the internet. In 2022, their shared frustrations with traditional search engines culminated in the founding of the platform, which launched in December of that year. Their goal was to create an AI-powered search engine that democratizes knowledge, which allows users to gain insights without wading through ads or sponsored links. The name Perplexity itself reflects this mission. The founders wanted to create a platform capable of helping users navigate complex questions with accuracy and clarity. The firm's development wasn't straightforward, and the founding team faced numerous technical and conceptual challenges. One of their early pursuits was creating a system that could translate natural language into SQL, which allowed users to query databases in everyday language. However, they quickly recognized that this approach was too limited. As a change of plan, they turned their attention to a more scalable solution a conversational search engine that combines real-time information retrieval with AI-driven language models. The turning point came with their innovative approach to answer generation. Rather than relying solely on web-based sources, its system could synthesize information from multiple models, which provides users with answers that are not only accurate, but also backed by citations from credible sources. This breakthrough was instrumental in attracting early attention, including a tweet from Jack Dorsey, which helped propel perplexity into the spotlight and build early momentum. Despite these successes, scaling the technology came with its own hurdles. The founders faced issues with processing vast amounts of data, creating reliable search indexes, and ensuring that their AI models could produce consistently accurate answers. However, their dedication to refining the platform paid off. Perplexity's conversational search model began gaining traction, which highlighted its potential to disrupt traditional search engines with a fresh approach centered on clarity, relevance, and citation-backed responses. Perplexity AI's growth trajectory has been nothing short of impressive. 
Within a year of its launch, the platform's user base grew rapidly, which attracted over 10 million active users. This rapid growth, along with increasing demand for its unique search capabilities, led to its 9 billion valuation recently. One of the most notable aspects of the organization's expansion has been its ability to secure high-profile investors and venture capital funding. In 2024 alone, Perplexity AI raised $165 million, backed by major investors like Amazon founder Jeff Bezos, NVIDIA, Databricks, and Meta's chief AI scientist, Jan LeCun. This influx of funding has enabled the company to continue refining its technology, expand its team, and enhance its infrastructure to handle even greater volumes of user queries. The company's valuation jumped from $500 million at the start of 2024 to over $9 billion, which earned it unicorn status in the startup scene. Several factors have contributed to its explosive growth. The company's commitment to providing high-quality, citation-backed answers has set it apart in a crowded market. By focusing on transparency and user trust, Perplexity has cultivated a dedicated user base, including high-profile tech leaders like Jensen Huang, CEO of NVIDIA, who has openly praised the platform's utility. This strategic approach, combined with the team's technical expertise and strong investor backing, has solidified its position as a formidable player in the AI-driven search engine market. Perplexity, a two-year-old search startup, has quickly emerged as a contender to Google. With an annual recurring revenue of $20 million, a valuation exceeding $1 billion and tens of millions of users, the company gained substantial traction. Perplexity raised $165 million in funding. However, this is significantly smaller compared to Google's resources, with AI partners like OpenAI and Anthropic raising over $11 billion and $7.3 billion, respectively. The operational costs for AI-driven search, estimated to be about 10 times higher than traditional search, add further pressure on perplexity to build a more sustainable business model. While its service currently lacks ads and relies on a $20 monthly subscription model, CEO Aravind Srinivas has hinted that ads could become part of its revenue strategy. On the other hand, Google has been the default search engine for many, delivering answers to countless queries. But lately, perplexity starting to challenge its dominance. It has become one of the most talked about products in the tech sphere. Investors, including Jeff Bezos, have shown confidence in its potential, leading to $74 million raised in a recent funding round at a $520 million valuation. Despite numerous startups attempting to unseat Google over the years, many, like Neva, struggled to gain a foothold. Now, though, Google's position seems less invincible. Users increasingly report frustration with Google search results filled with low-quality, spammy sites, turning some to alternative platforms like Reddit and TikTok or Perplexity AI for specific answers. Despite its successes, Perplexity AI has not been immune to controversy. In 2024, the company faced backlash over its web scraping practices, with major media outlets accusing the company of unauthorized content use. News Corp, the parent company of The Wall Street Journal and The New York Post, filed a lawsuit against Perplexity, alleging that the platform scraped their content without permission. The New York Times also issued a cease and desist order, further highlighting concerns about copyright and intellectual property in the age of AI-driven search. The company's response to these issues has been a mix of defensive statements and promises to improve its practices. The company argued that its platform operates within legal parameters and that it has implemented measures to respect robots.txt files, which are designed to control web crawler access. However, these assurances have done little to quell the media industry's frustrations, with critics arguing that Perplexity's model undermines publishers' revenue streams by bypassing paywalls and aggregating content. This controversy raised broader questions about the ethics of web scraping and content aggregation in AI search engines. Its approach to content sourcing has sparked a debate on how AI companies should balance information accessibility with respect for content creators' rights. As the company continues to grow, addressing these concerns will be crucial in maintaining its credibility and avoiding further legal challenges. Looking ahead, Perplexity AI has ambitious plans to reshape the future of search, to achieve this, the firm is investing heavily in AI-driven innovation, which aims to enhance its platform with more personalized features and advanced natural language processing capabilities. 
One of the company's future goals is to introduce an ad model that aligns with user values, prioritizing relevance and utility over traditional ad placements. Unlike Google, which generates significant revenue from search ads, Perplexity aims to implement a more targeted advertising approach, ensuring that any ads displayed are directly relevant to the user's query. This model reflects its commitment to user-centric design and could serve as a differentiator in a market saturated with ad-heavy platforms. In just two years, Perplexity AI evolved from a startup to $9 billion company, positioning itself as a strong alternative to Google and ChatGPT. By merging conversational AI with real-time information and citation-backed answers, it offers a fresh approach to search. Its rapid growth, backed by substantial funding, highlights its potential to reshape online information access. However, ethical concerns over web scraping and content rights present notable challenges. Its success will ultimately depend on its ability to maintain transparency, build user trust, and address these issues. Could this platform truly rival Google in the future of search?